Welcome, Linda, a global head of ESG research. Uh, it's been a good, fun day so far. You just came off the scene. Yeah. And there's a lot of people. It's a great event. A lot yes, of people. Absolutely. Uh, the rumors are we're having 7,600 streamers online. That's so amazing. I think Congratulations. Has, you know, I think it has a lot of, <laughs> lot of th with you guys, the, the, the speeches and the, mm. and the theme mm. ESG. Uh, first, can you briefly explain um, what ESG is? What well, ESG stands for Environment, Social and Governance. And those are really just three letters that, that probably are not very good at um, communicating what it is we're trying to capture. And those are really all the um, intangible risks um, that can affect the intrinsic value of a company and the future value of a company. Uh, and it's currently not very well captured by conventional financial analysis. No, we'll hope that's going to change. Yes. Uh, can you tell us a little bit uh, how MSCI works with ESG? Sure, so we are the largest provider of any kind of environmental, social and governance uh, information to the global investment community. So we collect all sorts of ESG information on companies, but, um, but what investors really work with are ratings of companies. We rate companies in every industry from a AAA for the top rated companies uh, to a triple C, which is the bottom rating that we have for companies in any um, given industry. Okay, thank you. Last question, uh, what's the biggest trends among the fund managers uh, who's using uh, ESG in their decision making? Well, I think that the, the biggest trend really is that uh, fund managers have now recognized that um, there doesn't have to be a trade-off between ESG and performance and that ESG is much more than simply screening out and excluding some stocks. So over the last couple of years we've seen a lot of great academic and industry research showing that uh, higher rated uh, ESG companies um, they tend to be less volatile, they are um, they are better financial quality and so a lot of fund managers are spending a lot of time um, trying to figure out ways to kind of work with that signal and to harvest that signal into their investment processes. All right, thank you very much. Have a safe trip back to right. New York. Thank you.